Hey everyone, it's me, Eden, from Lemonardi, and today we'll be talking about what the backpack is in Scratch. Those of you using Scratch might have seen this bar at the bottom of your editor that says backpack and wondered what it's for. Well, your backpack functions the same way a backpack would in real life where you carry it with you all around the Scratch community. You can put three kinds of things in your backpack. Scripts, costumes, backdrops, and whole sprites. Now, why would you want to put something in this backpack, you ask? Imagine if you or another person made a long script so that the user is able to draw on the screen and you're making a cake decorating game that would need the user to draw, but you don't want to recreate the entire function from memory, do you? To avoid doing this, you can use your backpack. You can use it in one of two ways, borrow the code from another one of your projects or borrow it from someone else's project. Using the same example, I have a Christmas cookie decorating game where you can draw the frosting on, and I had previously figured out a drawing game function, so I just imported it into this project and edited it so that it would work with what I already had. It saved me a lot of time. If I wanted to use a script from someone else's project, I would do the same thing. For example, I went inside of at advanced project and dragged this sprite into my backpack. Then I went into my own project and used it as instructions for the Genius Square game. Whenever you do this though, you have to make sure that you give the original creator credit if it was not you. I did this in the notes and credits section of the description. If you ever need to, you can right click and delete something from your backpack. In summary, the backpack is a great tool in Scratch that helps you reuse creativity from anyone in brand new ways and save a lot of time. Thanks for watching. Make sure that you like and subscribe so that you don't miss any Scratch tutorials. Bye!